Hello there. Today we are going to learn how to download, install, and use the Fall Talk application. You can find the application at Nexus Mods or Hugging Phase. Today we're going to use Hugging Phase. First, you click Files and Versions, Release, and Download Fall Talk 1.0. Click the Download button. Now let's enter the folder and double click the application to get started. The first thing you'll see a disclaimer of use. You must agree that you will not sell or use the voices for any nefarious purposes. It will then ask you to download the engines. It'll do that automatically later, so let's hit no for now. The app looks a little small, so let's go into settings and make it bigger. The first thing you'll notice in settings is that we have the Fallout 4 install directory and where we generate the output. Let's go down to interface zoom and set it to 125%. We'll need to restart the application now. Now we need to select an engine. We have five engines available. The first is RVC, which is real voice cloning. This can be used with a microphone or text-to-speech engine. Next is GPT Sovets. It's from the makers of RVC and has very good quality and is easy to drain. Voicecraft is an engine that allows you to edit existing files and get great results, something nothing else can do. XTTS is an engine made by the Cookie Team, the fan favorite. Finally, Style TTS is what many consider to be the best TTS engine available today. Let's choose RVC. Great, RVC is loaded. We can also choose which device to run this on. By default, we go to the GPU if it's available, but you can also run it on a CPU if you have an Intel GPU or AMD GPU. Let's go ahead and select a character to clone. I'm going to search for a protector on it. Just click the download button and it'll download automatically to our computer. This should be pretty quick. Now let's find our protector and load them up. We've been automatically switched to the recording page. Let's click the red button record something. Mr. Handy is the best robot in the wasteland. Mr. Handy is the best robot in the wasteland. Oh, that sounds marvelous. We can also use Edge TTS, which is a free TTS engine provided by Microsoft on all computers. Let's try it now. Hello, Mr. Handy. How are you today? I'm doing wonderful. If you have an 11 Labs API key set in the settings, you could use that, too. What's going on in here? Oh, my. Okay, maggots, I'm here to teach you how to use the GPT Solvitz engine. Let's select a good, strong robot soldier to make a voice for. The sentry bot is perfect! For TTS engines, you have to select a reference voice. A reference is what you want it to sound like when it generates. Initiating defensive procedures. Checking mapping protocol for... That's good. Let's select it now. Alert. Not... You can also show all your selected references with this button. If you want, you can add your own custom references. Let's switch to the Generation tab. Let's make him say something patriotic!
enemies of the United States Army. Let's adjust a few settings and regenerate the audio. Enemies of the United States Army must be eliminated. That sounds good. Let's go find where these files are to use them later. Let's go to where we've installed the application, the output folder, and the SentryBot folder. Hey, hey, what are you doing? What's this I hear about synthetic voices being made? This is an abomination. We need to edit the voices, not make new synthetic ones. Let's load the Loyal Paladin dance. Let's select a reference file. This one looks good. The news was like being kicked in the teeth. I mean, I've lost some of my brothers and sisters before, but his death, well, it really got to me. Huh, yeah. There's nothing synthetic about dance, that's for sure. Hey there, General. Let's go look at the frequently asked questions. If you need help, this should be the first place to look. Now let's go to the settings page. Every engine has its own settings that you can't find normally. These are complex and changing them could break things. But you're smart, you could do it. We interrupt this broadcast to talk to you about the About section. Here's where you can find our GitHub, our Coffee, our Nexus mod, and our Discord. Join our Discord today! It's the one place to talk about creating new models and updates to Fall Talk. See you there!